I need about 350. We're now in the future. Scan. This is a very Dragon Ball-like pod. It looks like something that Bulma would throw out of a capsule. Look at that. Beautiful. Wait, how do, how do I make it look at me? Hey! Look at this Whirlpool! Yep, that's clearly a four-star picture right there. Four stars. Everything I take is art. We're gonna get both of these Talos. Oh my god. The Dodrio scared them away. This is it. Look at this. Nope. Damn it. Grookey! This is my sword and shield starter right here. Look at this beautiful gal. Didn't even want to look at me. All right. Take a picture of Pichu. You see that? We're just going to capture photos of a deity just in their natural habitat. I'm surprised my camera didn't break. I'm a little overwhelmed right now because, like I said, I've waited 22 years for a sequel to Pokemon Snap. I just, I never thought we would ever get one. And I manifested it in that one random direct where they were like, Hey, uh, you've wanted this, right? And I was like, yeah, yeah, I want it. Sell it to me. I take my money. Turn around. Oh, yeah, that's the shot. Look at, look at that. Look at this. You're, you're gonna wave? Work for the camera. You're doing great, sweetheart. All right, so every single one of those pictures was fantastic. All four stars. See, I took 22 photos because I'm a man of quality, not quantity. I like how they drop them all in folders, so it makes it a little easier to go through them. We got one of a Molga, and it's just a Molga's back. I just love Talo's face because Talo looks like they don't give a crap. They look like Donald Duck version of a Pokemon. Why do I feel like taking a picture of Wurmpel was the easiest thing ever? Because Wurmpel moves at like two miles an hour. He doesn't look so good. Damn, this professor is very hard to please. Okay, this one has multiple Pokemon, so clearly, come on, this has to be better, right? Nope. I feel like I'm taking pictures and they're expecting me to be Andy Warhol on my first outing. Here's a picture of Grookey's butt. The important thing is that you tried, like this one right here. This belongs in a museum. All right, we got it sleeping. Shh, don't wake it up. Very majestic. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. Look at this. Come on, that is art. Oh, here we go. A crystal bloom that grows on Florio Island. Could have told you that. Oh, that Magikarp looks like he's in trouble. Uh, Magikarp, you good? You need some help? The Magikarp is just waiting for a bird Pokemon to just come put it out of its misery. Or that Hoot Hoot is sleeping. It kind of just feels like a ride at Disney World, because you get to the end, it's like, I don't want to get off the ride. I want to go again. Oh, a two-star photo. We're moving up in the world. She had to find the Dodrio that looked half dead. This Beedoof is too majestic. A new discovery. We don't even know what it is. It's just a foot. I think you're ready for a nighttime visit to Florio Nature Park. Let's see them glowy Pokemon. This Audino has been walking back and forth for days. <gasps> Score Bunny. Hey, hey, turn around. There you are. Don't wake him up. Don't you, don't you dare. I like how Professor Miru is just like, you know, these Illumina Pokemon, we've never seen them. They're just something of legend. And here I am like, uh, you know I have night mode on my camera, right? Got that Murkrow. Oh, Caterpie! Don't get too close to that pincer. We saw that episode of Pokemon with pincer cutting the Metapod in half, and they actually showed that. This score bunny. <laughs> score bunny's just doing zoomies. See, like, what, what constitutes is the perfect picture? I'm here. It's my mission to find it. Hey, hello, big girl! Bet that one turned out great. Combi, look at the camera. Look at the camera, you stupid honeycomb bee Pokemon. Whoops, took a picture of the Boofalant's ass. Or do we want to use the score bunny picture? I feel like that one's better. I like how this one counts as a Boofalant when score bunny is clearly the center of the picture. Ooh, three stars. It's funny how every single picture is a new discovery. He's like, none of these Pokemon have ever been documented in history. How is that a one star? I feel like... I'm being disrespected. This ain't my first rodeo taking pictures of Pokemon. So am I getting paid for this? Or getting school credit or something? Oh, that's not good. What is it? <gasps> it's a Mega Meganium. Hey, look over here. Turn around. Come on, you're like, yeah, that's it. Look at that face. That's the shot. This entire game is just trying to get me to take pictures of Pokemon's asses. It's like, take some booty shots. Is this like the boss fight of new Pokemon Snap? I'm struggling a little bit having two different ways to move the camera. You know, because back in my day, we only had one joystick. See, now here's the problem, like, which is the best one? So it's telling me what's two stars, what's one star. What, this one's not good enough? You don't want a picture of its big, dumb old head? I don't know how Professor Mirror is going to tell me that was only a two-star picture. They're going to give me a job! Hooray! They're like, we hired you. Now you can throw apples without us getting sued. We have apples now which means, look at these two, look at these two. It, it's nice to, you know, finally have a job after getting paid in exposure. 
Come on, stupid. Eat it. Eat the damn apple. That's the Pokemon you don't want to piss off. Ooh, that was a... Yo, look at that last one on the right. What if we add a fruit? Will, will that do anything? <gasps> it's a Molga. So it looks like we have infinite apples, so we can kind of just waste them. But I'm going to go ahead and go on record to say that Applin is probably not in this game. Because if you throw an apple at Applin, it, you know, cannibalism. Wow. They say a picture's worth a thousand words. That one tells quite the story. That Nodrio head on the right, that's totally me. All right, so I guess I can retire now. I'm saving my first four-star noteworthy behavior. Look how cute Grookey is. Seriously, Grookey, best starter, Gen 8. I feel bad waking the Pokemon up, but anything for art. So is there like a, a shield around this pod, around the Neo one that protects me? Or am I just pelting giant ass Pokemon with apples because I have huge balls? Okay, here's the picture we needed to get. Look at that. Look at these adorable little creatures. There we go. That's the shot. That in the uh, Pokemon photography business is what we like to call the money shot. Score Bunny is just Pokemon Sonic the Hedgehog. Someone had to say it. I don't know how some of these are only one star. Like, you're going to give this one star? Why does Hoo Hoo look like a kid that's like, hey, you got games on your phone? I don't know. Personally, I think this one's better, but we'll go with the one that's a, a higher point value because numbers dictate my life, which is why you should go subscribe so we can hit 500k this year. What do we get? As big as possible. We're talking about pictures, right? There's just something that kind of creeps me out about the way Pinsir opens its mouth and how the, the teeth kind of like, like some kind of xenomorph. It's kind of creepy. I, I guess you don't like apples? I don't blame you. I think apple's kind of a trash tier fruit. More of a citrus boy. I prefer citrusy for, I don't know, apples like in pies. Yeah, great, but I'm never in the mood for just an apple. Wait, a tangrowth? I didn't know you were there. Hello. There we go. Two ducklets. Todd! He's here! Hey, and they gave it's him a voice. A you know, Todd, the main character of the first Pokemon Snap game. Yeah, the glow up is real though. Can Who is this? Home, Looks like Gone from Hunter Hunter, but like store brand version. Oh, we're going to the jungle now. Yeah, it's like 150 degrees in here. These apoms are just frolicking. Not a care in the world. Bounce sweet. Come out of the tree, bounce sweet. Why am I slaky? Oh, hello! Hello, Beautifly! Come on, turn over. <laughs> Where's oh, is that a Quagsire? That's the thumbnail right there. Get out of the way, literally every other Pokemon but Quagsire. See, there's too much to do on the first run through. Like, if you want to... Ooh, a Lipard. There was a Skitty for a second. If you want to 100% this game, you got to go through every stage, like, 12 times. And I'm wondering if they're going to have some secret level at the end, like they had for Mew, when for some reason you just kind of go to the moon. Look, just like real life. When my cats are sleeping, I like to bother them. Why is this Quagsire just kind of sitting by the waterfall, looking like it's contemplating every decision it's made in his life? This is how I sit after I give a cashier money and they say, enjoy, and I say, you too. I like this one the best, only because Quagsire just looks so sad. Oh, a three star for that garbage? Okay, if this isn't a four star, I don't know what is. This is a great shot. This is amazing. How? How's it one star? Let's customize our Pokemon Instagram. I want to be the Instagram influencer of new Pokemon Snap. I want it to be that niche, as big as possible. Okay, that's going to be my first upload. Need a nice, clever caption. Perfect. Hold on. I feel like this is an opportunity to plug myself. So I just want to go out there and say, if you have the game, can you, like, go follow me on this? Is that a thing? Like, how does, uh, how does this work? Do I just pop up in, like, recommended? Can you follow a creator? Like, there's my code up there. So I, I guess if you can go follow creators, there it is. Where'd that Arbok come from? I feel like it doesn't want apples, though, so I don't know why I'm bothering throwing them. It probably you know, want to eat like a Pikachu or something. Oh, hold up, there's Apom. Its tail just looks like the glove that SpongeBob gets when he goes to Glove World. Ew, glove flavored. That's a way better shot of pick a peck Yo, look at that shot. Do you know Arbok backwards is Cobra and Ekans backwards is, or forwards is Snake and Muck backwards. This is my top shot, really? It's one star. I'm just like stuck in the jungle now. I gotta find my way out. Please, can you give me directions out of here? It almost feels like being at a really interactive zoo. Only none of these animals would ever harm me. Right, the Pokemon company? That's the Ooh, that's a good one. Ooh, that was a good one. Just gotta find a way to get it to evolve into a Gyarados. I feel like there's another item further down the line that we have to get, kind of like when we got the smoke ball. 
I feel bad because he's like, whoa. Oh. It's pretty dark out there. No, like it, it literally is very bright. This thing's got night mode. Don't worry. Look how majestic the life hard in their natural environment. What is that? Oh, here's just a group of Morlo. This is gonna be a good shot. I can tell you right now. Turn around. Oh, damn it! It's spored all over the place. Oh, he killed it. Is it still there? Yep, it's dead. Oh no! Oh, I missed him. I like how people keep asking me if this game's worth it, but I feel like Pokemon Snap is a very hard game for me to sell to somebody since I think it's mostly based on nostalgia, for me at least. Because, like, how do you justify telling somebody, hey, pay 60 bucks and you can take pictures of Pokemon? It's just, it's more to it than that. I can't really explain it. Quagsire's glowing. W what is up with that, Quagsire? I'm sorry about this. I truly am. <laughs> No, it baffles my mind, because, like, look at this picture right here. And, like, look at this picture. And, like, the centering, and there's multiple Pokemon, and then, like, this. This is the three-star. Or this, you know what? No, upload the body. That's evidence. It's one more lull mourning over the loss of another. Look at this. Art often imitates reality. Saving more pictures of Quagsire. Don't mind me. Day four. Audino is just still pacing back and forth. Observe. You can use these orbs to send- Oh, so they're going to give me something to light up the flowers now. That's cool. Can you throw the light up things at Pokemon? It looks like they just kind of- Oh, I can make them glow! I don't know, like, what good that does, but I do know that, like, we want to throw it at, at this, right? Yo, look at this pincer. That's a mean-looking pincer. Instagram influencers call this the golden hour. I don't know, like, what good this does. Oh, it makes them freak out. So we're basically just throwing a filter. Oh, really? That's a good shot. That Magikarp is dead. Oh, wait, no, it's alive. It's okay. <gasps> a Sylveon? Where have you been hiding? I mean, not even best evolution, but like, hey, I'll take it. That's a good picture. <gasps> we got a four-star. I have no idea how this is a four-star picture, but I will take it. All right, I guess that's enough Pokemon Snap for now. I've scratched the itch that I've had on my back for 22 years, and it feels damn good.